Welcome to another mega exciting five minute water ring. Let's play this with an early bishop f5. I would find this slightly annoying if I was playing it with white. <clears throat> Try and knock down things for white. Okay, okay. Is bishop b4 check? Good here. Or bishop b4, queen a4, the knight c6. Still looks tempting. Hang on, hang on, let's just slow down. Let's just slow down. There's things like attacking the bishop now and attacking the queen, but king d2. But need to slow down here. Knight takes c3 is hitting the bishop on d3. If takes knight takes e2 check. So if he castles, knight takes c3. But here, knight takes c3 is also potentially interesting. Here, bishop takes and knight takes f2. Takes on here. Take the rook. So it's already, it is a pretty interesting position. What about just knight takes c3 there? And takes check. I don't know, it's, it's very actually, it looks as though this is complicated. Does my knight get out there to tell the tale? After knight takes f2. <clears throat> knight f2, f2, bishop g6. Hmm. So I take on c3 for knight f2? Check. It's, it's intriguing. I don't know if it's going to work. Knight f2 here. Bishop g6, knight takes h1. It might be b5 if the bishop returns, but it's c4. Oh, it's fun anyway. I'm a minute down since I've started looking at this. Let's go for it. I think there's b5 on bishop d3, or there's queen b5. Um, there's queen h4 check. Uh, um, doesn't really. Well, maybe it's useful for getting the light out. Check. G3 queen takes h2. King for mates. Otherwise, yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe it was worth the hassle to do this. But queen b7 is winning material there. Maybe knight c6 first. Um. Ah, uh, all right, no, actually. All right, there's queen f6 on bishop g3, but this one is winning material. Hmm. I'm losing material, aren't I, to rook f1, simply. Ah, rook f1, okay. Okay. <clears throat> all right, that's more interesting I think than rook f1 from my perspective where is this king going can't really bring his king up here can he All right queen d3 check why don't I just take on e3 what a, what a moron why don't I consider taking on e3? Right, this is all a bit too quick. Um, I'm going to bring the knight into the game, but I'm a piece down now. Oh. 
can you consolidate this position? It might be, it looks a little bit as though it could be tricky if my knight comes to e4 with his king still there. Although on the other hand, queen f3. Hmm. I've got a pawn for the piece. It's not that much. Great. There's no rook b8. If I get knight d5 in it, it looks like a strong knight of knight f4. He's let, I don't know why he's letting my um, pieces improve though, but my rook's not improving here that without any rook b8. This is a, I don't know what I'm doing here without any rook b8. <clears throat> mm. Can I at least try and win another pawn over here? The bishop d6 immediately. <laughs> that gives me a pass to a pawn, so I'm just I have to make some problems for the opponent here. There's bishop, no, no bishop d6 just yet. What about f6 as a safety point? I think knight f4, queen c3. Can I cause problems? He's a bishop up, but he's moving pretty slowly here. I don't know, maybe he's slightly concerned. The knight's pretty good. I'll play for h6. I'm not gonna let him play h6. He has me h5, h6. All right, okay. Can I do this? The knight's holding f6 against rook f6. So want to get this pawn to cause some issues. I do remember Mikhail Tal game in Blitz Championship. Okay, that's, there's a piece down, but let's go here so avoid losing the rug. He had this past a pawn in one of the key games in one of the official Blitz, first official Blitz World Chess Championship. They cause some problems with past a pawn. Okay. <clears throat> oh, is that the end of that night? Take um, one knight c7. If I keep it on the board, <laughs> just in case, uh, it was nice, but it's been uprooted. Try and keep things protected. No king f7 and knight d5. King f7 and knight d5. Well, I think it's problematic. If my king goes up there. Yeah, I wonder if I should have tried to stop. Um, that construction. <clears throat> Let's try and pre move a bit. Rook F7. Time warning. Check. 
Check. Check. Things panicking Check. a bit. Check. Check. Oh, got him on the buzzer. Oh, <laughs> oh no, no, I don't like the, the premium delays on this server. Yeah, so I, I, I don't, I don't count any check-ins before they hatch. That <laughs> I thought I was going to lose on time. Basically, in the end. Oh, yeah, I, I just had to create some problems. I, I was too lured in I, by the point that his bishop, he's waving it as a loose piece. So knight takes c3, hitting the bishop. Who takes? Let's check. Takes knight takes f4. It's better for black. Can't navigate this that easily. Well, that would have been check. better than this. Knight takes f2 is mentioned by the engine. Mentions queen takes b7 immediately, but funny enough, saving the rock is mentioned. Check. So I think also while the queen is actually supporting d7 to make that more effective, <laughs> it's a good idea to encourage this because I think, well, that's okay. So if you waste time here, then that's actually a threat in knight a5. Yeah, I was too worried about the knight immediately with trying to rescue it. Check. Uh, so I've made queen b7 more effective. So this is this is looking good. And so he tries to win the knight. I can use this one. Come here. This should have been fine. Oh no, it should, it's it's easy in hindsight. <laughs> yeah, when it's spelled out. Now this position is so much more Check. improved. If we have this position, actually, knight, what? Check. Knight e4 is possible. Ah, the knight doesn't have to go to a, a self pin. Isn't there just this? Oh, knight e4 is possible. Hitting the rook, okay. Uh, okay, Check. okay, so I, I've managed to make queen takes b7. Although, even this, Check. the engine doesn't mind. Ah, e5 does mean queen c6 is threatened if it takes. This is all very tactical. Is knight c6 threatened? I think this is queen goes back. Oh, in that rook over there, it is very, very tactical. Oh, blimey. Oh, as I win the queen. Okay, yeah. e5, brilliant move for queen b6. Wow. e5 would be a brilliant move here. Yeah. Check. I'm just a piece down here, just trying to cause some problems. Unfortunately, I'm piece down for not much. I have to cause some problems. The A pawn was a bit of a nuisance. I thought he was a bit slow and then he speeded up when he's about like 12 Check. seconds here. I thought we've got to get, got to get into the pre move mode. Also, there's past pawn stuff Check. going on. Thankfully, I wasn't losing a knight uh, rook here Check. that easily. Check. My passport is good, Check. but yeah, we're both pre-moving. I have to try and mate him, basically. Check it's me. good that pawn finally is part of a mating that they're stopping king d3. A fun one. Comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.